3rd of August 2019, Hutton Woods. Just seen a really, really large bird, big hawk. I don't know if it was a peregrine falcon, it really looked like it could have been. It had a huge wingspan. And it, when I first seen it, I thought it looked like it was carrying something, like a rabbit or something. And then it disappeared and then it came back and it went around these trees. And I tried to focus, but I couldn't get it focused. It uh, lives around here somewhere. It was going from tree to tree, and every time I focused, it would move. It would move. Anyway, we're coming up to an area now, up the top of that hill there, which I might have to end up climbing in a minute if this is too bad up here. There's a stretch along here that's always really, really badly overgrown. Whereas if you just sneak up there, you can get on the golf course straight away and you won't be having to run the gauntlet of these ferns. Um, it's not a huge stretch, but it is... I'll go up to it and see. If not, I'm going to climb up there and get up on the golf course. Hopefully nobody's hitting this way yet. <sighs> Otherwise, I've got to plough through like a really ferny area with singing nettles. Um, <sighs> you know, if it's not used very much, then nobody bothers to tidy it up here. And I'm looking at it now. It's looking extremely overgrown. <sighs> Even if I just get through this bit, let's have a look. If I had winter clothes on, I'd plan through here. <sighs> I might be able to do it. I just got put up with a ferns. <sighs> you don't know what's going to get you. It is quite... You can just about do it. And it might open up in a minute. If you can just... <clears throat> Plow through. That's it. And then you have to check yourself. I'll just stop here a minute. In case there's anything got on me. They'll get you anyway. I can't tell from your back, can I? So I've just plowed through that. A small gauntlet. Um... More to come. Oh, and I heard a gopher. Hear that? That's a gopher. So it looks to me as if I couldn't have gone up there. I would have been right on top of a load of gophers. So I've ploughed through there. But there's more to come, folks. More to come. This is the only time of the year it is like this. There's lots of butterflies, so. And of course, if you come in the winter, you've got all your winter clothes on, but you don't have this. You see? It's not well walked. Hardened locals will use it. They will use it to take their dogs out. And I'm videoing it. So that people can see the sort of terrain I negotiate. You've got to avoid touching these things. They can bring you out in massive blisters. So avoid them if you can. Like don't let them touch your face or anything. See that these big things here. Reminds me of being a kid, we were always bashing our way through places when I was a kid. Right, I'll be going up there in a minute. But before we do that, I've come from through there, right? There are signs you are allowed. Now, if we just weave up here a minute, just for a second, though, I'm not going this way, I'll just show you the golf course. I remember when they were building this golf course, I walked up from the other end of it, from Weston. I 
just come up here a minute because there are some quite good views. Please keep the path. This will take you out to the little bench on the Roman road that I was at the other day. I can see some golfers now. And uh, there's golfers over there, see? And I'm going over that way. Just let him hear him hit. Ready? Just wait and see. There we go. Anyway, there's a golf course up there. We just walk up to the the top bit here a minute. And then I'll go back down. You can see Weston all over there. This is another way if you came up from Bleeden up the hill up Hellinge Hill and you came this way and you keep this path there's a way out over there somewhere but anyway I'm going to be making my way down by that wood over there there's golfers over there look and if they lose their ball in this lot I bet there's a lot of golf balls in here they have fun finding them He had another go. I think the first set was crap. Yeah, we'll be going to, on a designated pathway now. There's a lot of white horses over there. I'm just going to turn off while I take some pictures.